Uh, here comes my buddy. Um, bye. Oh, duh. Look out! Ah! Ah! The crazy! Crazy! So, oh, get any on ya? So here's another video. Another video. Hang on, buddy. Hang on. Hang on, Axel. Foley. Wait, what? So, again, another video. Mm. Well, what science says is wrong. Essentially, the moon is there up in the sky, and this camera is not the best. Bug. Let's see. Uh, focus. Yeah. See the moon there? It's not full as you can see. And yet, the sun is just over the rooftop there. And look, the sun is locally illuminated, as you can see. That is not 93 million miles away. See the halo around the sun, or whatever you want to call that. If it was 93 mile, mile, million miles away, all those beams of light, and it's so huge, would apparently be hitting us parallel. 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 So again, zoomed in, the moon, not fall, and panning over the sun up there in the sky. That's not in a bureau flying around. It's just a reflection. Or, oh, my God. Well, those weird blinking effects. So, see what I'm saying? It is approximately quarter to five, September 23rd. No asteroid hit. I don't know what happened with the Pope and Obsama bin Lion. But there's the sun. Okay. And there's the moon. If they're both in the sky at the same time, why is that moon not full? Obviously, all of those rays from that sun over there, since the moon is not behind the Earth's shadow or something, it should be full. Makes no sense. I mean, as far as science is concerned, what they say makes no sense. It's complete and utter on a barbed wire fence. Wait, utter on a barbed wire fence? Ah, oh, poor cow. So again, the sun over there, and then the moon up there, not full. Yeah, what an exciting video, I know. Anyway, blah, blah. Taking a picture of my underwear, wait, what? Anyway, cheers, ladies and germs. The earth is flat.